Welcome back to CTV Morning Live. Melissa, how are you? Oh, good. How are you? I'm good. And we're uh, getting ready for each Easter. Of course, we're doing That's our right. Pinterest segment. Our Pinterest segment. We're doing one each day this week. So okay. I broke it up into themes. And today we're doing a bunch of crafty things you can do with the kids. And these are also things that you can keep and use from year to year. So it's going to be kind of fun, but yet it. useful. It's almost like a... a, a like a decoration you put away and bring out every exactly. year, right? And so, exactly. Um, this is so cute. Can and today, you know, I'm using this one for kids, and I'm sticking with uh, playing on my my own name, Lamb. So I'm right. making these little <laughs> lambs, and so uh, super easy to do. And it actually is very useful. And I'll show you at the the last second what you can actually use this for. Okay. And super easy to do. First of all, you just grab something kind of stiff. This is an old uh, Christmas card. Oh, perfect. So um, reusing. I like that. Uh, yeah, reusing. And it's cardboard, so it's a bit heavy, so it will actually stand up. I've never up. been good at cutting. So lines. you want me to cut? Is Honestly. that it? Yeah, if you could. All right. I'm pretty sure I can manage it. Look at her go. Right yeah. on the line. You should be good at speed. cutting. <laughs> Shouldn't you be cutting all the little things for your kids? So I suggest, yes. you know, parents <laughs> probably cut the perfect. circles out ahead of time. Okay. In this case, we're both adults. I can handle the, yeah, the cutting of the circles. Keep the safety scissors around That's if right. you kids want to do it. Um, and the second step is really easy. It's basically Q-tips, and that's what's going to be your body. Yeah. So for I was doing this earlier. This is and you fun. were cutting them, except they fly all over the place. So I you, try to. Keep, I you do got to be kind of careful here. You, yes. Oh, you've mastered the technique, have. have you? So Look at you. you. Cut low on the, the scissor. The master Q-tip cutter, Jeff Hopper. One so, more to do. And that's how the the uh, actual uh, wool is made. That's on the how lamb. the wool is made on the lamb. And uh, my glue is clogged. Unfortunately. Oh, is it really? Okay. Well, we let's have use to open it, and that's what I've been doing this morning. I just used a Q-tip to Perfect. dab on the glue. And you only need a craft glue because it's not nothing very strong. So okay. this is a... And don't be afraid of it either because these don't are heavier, Don't be afraid right? of it. Exactly. Okay. So you just want to kind of gob on your glue. And then from there, you're just going to kind of create your little you body. center out or outside you in? You know what? I, I start with the in. bum and go toward because it grows, right? right? Okay. Start right. with your little bum. All right. And you just kind of throw all these on like this here. That's so cool. And uh, eventually it'll build, and you can layer them as you see on this one here. You can layer them over top of each other. Just make sure to be really friendly with the glue and gob Oops. it on. Glue's sticky, turns out there, Melissa. That's right. This is really fun because you're taking really up some fun. time to do something in the finished product. That's right. Uh, the kids are going to love. The end. It's, it, it's honestly, something you as a can parent, use. It buys some time. That's right. And if you get, do. and the thing is, it's safe. If you get everything cut up and organized ahead of time, you know, mm -hmm. you can kind of let the kids glue. Why? Maybe you're making Easter dinner, and I'll show you what the goal of this little lamb is to it. do. So, so Jeff, I'm inviting you for dinner at uh, my house okay. here this Easter. Okay. Nice. So you are going to know where to sit because this can be used as a table setting. Isn't that cute? Look at that, and then it stands up. Most of the time, <laughs> just on have level to make surfaces. sure. On level surfaces, yes, it stands up on my desk. That's for right. sure. There you go. And so basically, you're going to glue all your little Q-tips on, and then you're going to glue the, the clothes pegs pins. to the right. back of the lamp. Just make sure that the open part is facing up, so you can clip your little place setting card in that. that and now, then it stands up. I know we ran through this fairly fast. If you we want to did. learn how to do this, it's all on our Pinterest site, CTV Otmore Live. It's the same as our Twitter handle, and right. there's step by step directions. And there's tons of other crafts on there. I wish it was up right now so we can show you, but we actually found this little, a little chicky, and it's made out of basically a styrofoam ball, some mm -hmm. tissue paper, googly eyes, and, and pipe cleaners little chicky that steps up so it's super cute and the cool thing is that we also uh, I think we link from our Facebook page to that if you want an easy way exactly. to get to the Pinterest site, exactly right? and the best thing about Pinterest is there's so many great ideas but you just see the board so you can just see the finished product but if you click into the site it'll bring you to the site it gives you step-by-step -step directions on how to do everything so it's super easy to follow and right. uh, very user-friendly as well and you can find simple things like this to do that you can reuse year after year or you can find hard things to do as well so really, you're I'm determined to get this one, done eh? I know one more thing I want to run over here What's is that? we put the glue on top of yeah these. and I mean if you my glue is actually working it would right. be a lot easier to just kind of squirt it through but and then it would just lay over and like then you that? just place them on top okay. yeah and I mean there's no form um, another option you can use if you have cotton balls that's another great thing you can use just cotton kind balls of, might be faster cotton balls is probably but a lot not, faster not but you won't get the, the little wooly it's effect true. like that it's you know true. that you really get the little wooly effect and then I just did a little bow out of ribbon okay and then the, the circle that you cut out the smaller circle gets actually glued on the yes that's right and so when I'd be done I would make my little face and just 
remember to do the face at the bottom half of the circle because okay. you want to leave room for the little ears and hair at the top. I you saw someone on, on Facebook talk about get, on purpose getting glue on their hands just so they can peel it off. Never do that. It's kind of a weird fetish. <laughs> <laughs> you uh, you'd be way too perfectly neat and clean. No, no. Boys you and ask crafts, my family, they boys would say, and crafts, it's all no, over the place. Girls honestly. and crafts too, and my room is really? definitely not uh, tidy. By any I love means. that. All right, well, yeah. so go to uh, our Facebook page. That's right. be linked to the Pinterest, or go straight to Pinterest if you're on Pinterest, which you should be. And it's really tons fun. of more ideas just besides this one here. Okay. We have tons of Easter stuff going on right now on it. Thanks, Melissa. Very you're cool. Welcome. We have a cool little place setting and everyone yeah, will be jealous. Yeah, you're invited to my house for Easter dinner. Thank you kindly. All right, we'll be back with more on CTV Morning Live after this.